Live from Las Vegas, Nevada, it's The Cube at IBM Interconnect 2015. Brought to you by headline sponsor, IBM. Hi, this is Ariana Grado here with Cube on the ground, and we're here tuning in from IBM Interconnect in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I'm really excited, uh, Stu Miniman is here, he's a senior analyst at Wikibon, and we're gonna be talking about social media. Excellent. So, Stu, can you tell us a little bit about the importance of social media for business? Wow, uh, so Ariana, I, I've been, uh, I dove into the social space uh, quite a few years back. Uh, I was pretty early on Twitter, my Twitter handle's Stu, and everybody kind of is like, oh my gosh, you, know, you must have been really early, but uh, kind of a loophole I got it in after back in 2008 but um, fr from a business standpoint um, you know there's a few things first of all uh, social is about turning it from really broadcasting to really having a conversation I've always looked at uh, you know t you know the social media tools is helping you to, to build those conversations uh, sometimes in, in the past really before the social piece it was really at shows where you got to get together with people in your industry maybe you emailed with them um, and now social media really extends those conversations out there into the public. It's a good, uh, you know, space to really dialogue and have chat rooms and uh, do, do lots of different ways to engage and, uh, you know, find people with common interests. Uh, and uh, you can even make new friends too, which is kind of an added bonus. Yeah, definitely. So you mentioned the phrase, join the conversation and engage the crowd. Can you talk a little bit about either one of those, what those mean? to you and maybe the importance of, of that? Yeah, so, uh, you, you know, it's interesting. If you look at any kind of, uh, you know, dynamics, you can talk about communities. Uh, the, the old pyramid used to be uh, that, you know, 90% of the people just lurked, 9% of the people maybe did a little bit, and 1% were the, you know, real contributors out there. Um, when uh, Dave Vellante, one of our co-founders, Wikibon, founded the company, he says, you know, I'm a one percenter, and one percenter back there meant that, you know, maybe you're the, the troublemakers, you're the ones that created a lot of content and help engage people um, and social is really about trying to turn that pyramid upside down let's let 90% of the people engage in that conversation and be part of it uh, you know here at the, the show uh, interconnect we're talking a lot about open source mm -hmm. and open source is really about everybody being involved in it uh, the, the, the the latest survey I saw on open source said that over half of all enterprises you know are con you know not only using open source but are contributing to open source so it's a real change in the IT industry it's a real change in our dynamics as as, as workers and uh, there, there's a lot of opportunities opportunity there. Awesome. So you talk about open source. How can crowd engagement and open source go together? How can they be involved? Well, in, in many ways they can go together. So uh, just as uh, anybody can contribute to the conversation, anybody can contribute to open source. So you could start out by just, you know, reviewing things or adding code, uh, you know, going to meetups, uh, going to hackathons, uh, and, you know, getting involved deeper. Uh, you know, IBM and, you know, a broad part of their ecosystem are heavily involved. We've been talking at, at this show, um, th things like, uh, you know, OpenStack and Docker, uh, and really these are driven a lot by the community. So, uh, you know, r really amazing to see, a, like OpenStack, and Docker, just huge participation from, you know, not just one or two big companies, but lots of startups, lots of individuals getting involved, putting their passion into their work, and the whole industry as a whole gets to uh, take advantage of that. Awesome, so last question, as an analyst, what do you think the importance of big data with social media, how do they go hand in hand, and how can they come together? All right, so, uh, you know, I, I, I focus more on the infrastructure piece, but from, I, I do keep a little bit of an eye on, on, on big data, um, and, you know, social media is one of those sources of data. Uh, you, you and I have been involved with the crowd chats that we've been doing. Uh, you know, we're creating a lot of that social signal out there, so looking at the analytics, looking at, you know, what's, what's trending, what's getting involved, uh, and taking that piece forward, it's really, being able to take action from that information which social media and, and big data are a big part of. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Stu. You can find Stu at, at Stu on Twitter. And I'm Ariana Grado with The Cube here in Las Vegas, Nevada at IBM Interconnect. Thanks for tuning in.